Hello everybody and welcome to South Carolina Tabletop Speedway, where we are ready to hold the first ever 187 NASCAR race on the NASCAR Legend Series channel. This race is sponsored by the NASCAR Legend Series, whose next race should be coming out next weekend if there are no more altercations, which there may be. See, this is a very short track, very slick track. In practice, we had Kyle Busch spin. There's no smoke from his tires. Very odd surface they have down here. But as you see, these 187 drivers are ready to go. All lined up, and they're going to um, go from a grid start, which is something that we haven't done ever before. See Kevin Harvick there on pole. He was fastest in qualifying. Could be good. Hunt Brothers keep the car. William Byron was also very fast in practice, and then Kyle Busch, as we said before, spun out in qualifying and starting the back. Now let's get to your starting grid. On the front row is Kevin Harvick, Alex Bowman, and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Row 2 will be Denny Hamlin, Alex Bowman, and Chase Elliott. Row 3 is Austin Dillon, Jimmy Johnson, and Ryan Newman. Row 4 is Ryan Blaney, Paul Menard, and Daniel Hemrick. And then rounding out the field is Kyle Busch. Now, today's race facts are this is going to be a 5-lap quick sprint event. Kevin Harvick's on the pole, 7% chance of rain, and there will be no caution for accidents. You will race through it if somebody crashes, and the green flag is out, and all the cars get off. Kevin Harvick, from that outside position, is able to come down quickly and maintain the lead. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. is chasing him hard, though. Going, diving down back into turn 1, as you see the sunlight starting to fade a little bit, and then Ryan Bellini gets in the back of Paul Menard and Austin Dillon, and we're caution car comes out? The caution car, I'm being told, is coming out because the lack track lights would not fire. See, now they're now they're up and running, so the pace car is gonna they're gonna go ahead and clean up this incident. Ryan Blaney just getting into the back of Paul Menard, hitting Austin Dillon. Unfortunate circumstances for those two. Wrong place, wrong time. So those two will be out now that the lights are working. We will be going back under green here in just a moment. Now the pace car is off, and green flag is back in the air. Two laps left to go. Stenhouse is going to bump Kofi and Harvick out of the way. Four wide down the back stretch now. And there go Bowman and Byron, Elliott and Stenhouse all around. Ryan Newman takes the white flag down into turn one and two. Denny Hamlin can't get to him. In three and four, Newman's going to go a little bit wide here. Hamlin into the back of him, and it's going to be close at the line, but Newman's going to hang on. So they're both sliding down to the inside there. See, Stenhouse bumps our leader, Harvick, out of the way. This awesome four-wide moment captured on another camera down the backstretch. But that ultimately led to all three Hendrick cars, other than Jimmy Johnson spinning out and Ryan Newman's teammate Stenhouse spinning out. And then Denny Hammond could not finish the deal on that pass. So Ryan Newman will be your winner today. Fantastic race we had here from South Carolina Short Track. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Again, National Legend Series should be out next weekend is what I'm hoping for if I can get all the filming done. Depends on how busy my schedule is. That's all I have to say for this video, so thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a good night.